Hi guys, this video talks about something else which is not related to maths, verbal or logic. Uh, most of students are calling me saying that they are not able to get good marks in their mocks. They are not scoring well, they don't think the cat can happen, they don't think they are able to score as much as required for the cat. The problem what we have is we are thinking from the percentile point of view. In all the examples, cat, zat, snap, and mat, cet. Uh, everyone is running around percentile. 99 percentile, 99.99 percentile, 99.95 percentile. Fine. That's the reason why we are feeling sad or why students are not able to perform up to their caliber. Yep, I'll tell the reason for that. The main reason for that is all over life we have never talked about topping the exam. We always talk, talked about passing the exam. Fine. All my four, four years of engineering I did same thing. How much I need to score so that I could pass. Fine. And as an engineer I had a confidence in myself that yes I can pass the exam. I never th thought to be number one. Yep. I never wanted to be number one. Fine. The problem of percentile is you are targeting number one position. Fine. If we have enough time for the mocks for the exams, for example, from today around three months for you are there for CAT. Fine. So at this time I won't be scoring, I'm not scoring that good percentile because I'm not yet started. Yep, you're scoring 60, 70 percentile. But yes, there are people who are scoring 99 percentile. Anyone who is scoring 99 percentile three months before the exam is a repeater. Fine. Remember that. Anyone who is scoring 99 percentile in the mocks today is a repeater. If I give you my example, my first percentile was 92 percentile. Fine. I took the first mock in August time, around three, two and a half months before CAT. I was 92 percentile in the first mock. Fine. You are not his competition as of now, but you will become his competition in the next couple of months. So when I'm talking about two months before CAT, one month b b before CAT, yes, then your mock scores are main bond scores. Fine. So th th that's the first thing. The percentile is a misnomer as of now. Fine. Second thing is I don't want you to talk about percentile. I want to talk about the percentage. All over life we talk about percentage. I need 60% marks to pass the exam and I used to get those marks. Fine. Then why we are not doing this now? Okay. L let me give you the target. If have you ever scored 60% in your life? Yes. 10, 12 uh, quality days. 60% marks. If you again do the same in exams. Let's talk about CAT. Out of 100, if you are able to do 60 questions right, you will be 99 percentile plus in fact 91.5 percentile plus for sure fine so don't run about per around percentiles run around percentage marks fine CET 200 mark paper is going to be there fine out of that if you are able to score 150 marks that is 75 percent marks you are going to Jamnagar Bajaj fine so stop talking about percentiles talk about percentage trust me that's a, one of the biggest motivator for you fine for the first few mocks especially in this phase when we have enough time for cat don't think about a percentile think about the percentage percentage is something we can target percentile is a very very vo volatile term that will change according to the exam that will change according to the uh, person to person if you are not in a good mood you might not be able to score that good marks fine so stop running around percentile we talk about percentage and trust me you start feeling confident Fine. So target percentage rather than percentile. All the best.